Hi, Jackie Sage here. This is post 12 of the Ultimate Blog Challenge. And yes, once again, I have skipped some posts. Uh, I will eventually go back, maybe, and fill those in. Uh, I wanted to talk today about totem animals. Um, those of you who have been following me know that I have taken a job as a waiver for Liberty Tax. And that means putting on a turquoise velour toga and cavorting around and waving at people. Uh, basically, I have a great big red foam hand and I just sit there all day going, hoo, 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 la, 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 and getting everyone's attention. And the idea, of course, being that, you know, get enough attention and show them, point toward Liberty Tax so that they'll go in there and get their taxes done. And so that they'll associate getting their taxes done with fun and enjoyment rather than with, you know, pulling teeth and things like that. Anyway, yesterday while I was way busy waving, this great-tailed grackle, which is one of the birds of the Sonoran Desert, um, it's, um, it's in the uh, raven family, the uh, Ictidae, Ictidae, I can't remember, I'll have to look that up. But anyway, it is an or it is an oriole, raven, you know, same dip, same type of category of birds. Um, the males are black with purple heads. The females are a kind of a dark brown with a cream underbelly. Uh, well, it's not really cream; it's like more of a light tan underbelly. Anyway, uh, the females are usually really, really um, easily scared, and they're the last to land and the first to take off. Uh, when you see a group of grackles. And so yesterday when this female grackle did everything it could to get my attention uh, and was like only a foot away from me most of the time and like dancing circles around me, uh, I, I realized that you know this is a, this is a visitation from a totem animal. Um, my usual totem is the swallowtail, the zebra swallowtail butterfly, which is beautiful yellow and black butterfly that uh, is very common in Ohio and also in uh, North Carolina. And as a matter of fact, I have some really awesome photos of uh, a group of swallowtails that had landed uh, on the ground, and there were like 30 or 40 of them. Um, they had landed in a little water spot and were sipping water, uh, and that was really, really fun. Uh, but this grackle, uh, I went to look up what the meaning of a visitation from a grackle is. And grackles uh, refer to repressed or suppressed emotion, uh, kind of a, you know, clogging your energy channel with, with too much, uh, too many different emotions, too much uh, conflict, uh, too much anxiety, too much fear. Um, and that you need to, you know, think about what's going on and, and figure out what exactly it is that you need to do uh, to change things. And one of the changes that I made is that I no longer write for content mills unless I really, really like the topic. Uh, I, t I have a uh, plan to get a s another job. Right now I have the Liberty Waving job and I have a job on uh, doing phone surveys and I have a plan to get my food service handler's card uh, because I want to be uh, I want to be doing jobs where I'm making that personal connection with people in the real world. Um, I think we are we, we become really detached. We get really wonderful friendships online, and yet our day-to-day, face-to-face friendships tend to suffer as a result. <coughs> Forgive me, I have a cold today. And I'm not going to end this video because I like the beginning of it, so bear with me. Um, I want to make sure that what I'm doing uh, brings people joy. And that's why I love my Liberty Waving job because, you know, that moment when people's face goes from, oh my god, I'm traveling along and I have to get to work, to, ha, oh my god, that's so funny. Um, I like that moment. I really like that moment, that connection. I mean, today, um, these guys in a uh, moving van, there were like six or seven of them, and they were beeping and waving and, you know, doing as much to get my attention as I was doing to get theirs, and it was just, it was fun. It, you know, that, that moment of, yes, you exist, I exist, we know each other, 
you know, um, that's a great moment. Anyway, I want to do uh, things in the real world. I don't want to just have friends online, and that's nothing against my online friends. I have marvelous online friends. You know, Jordan in Mississippi, Tristan in Maine, Michael and uh, Aubrey and Jordan in Phoenix. You know, Chrissy, who I, I haven't seen since uh, June or July. I, I did see her face to face at the coffee shop, but it's been a while. Hunter, uh, thank goodness Hunter, Hunter and uh, Andrew came to dinner. That was really awesome. But I want to do more of that. I want more face to face, more direct contact, more, um, more time spent with people in the real world. So anyway, think things over and my question for you today and I hope that you'll you know comment below uh, is what emotions are you stuffing what things do you need to do to make a change in your life and I'm not just talking about the kind of change where oh my god my life sucks and blah 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 blah, blah. I'm talking about you know you've got a life that's, that's fairly good but it could be better you know it could be better so I want I want people to think about what do you need to do today and what real world thing can you do right now, you know, right after you turn off this video that will make a change in your life. And post your comments below, uh, make video responses because that's really fun, I'd love to watch them. And join the Ultimate Vlog Challenge and also come and visit my, uh, my blog that's Tempe Tempest dot blogspot.com and also look up my stuff on tryon.com uh, that's under Meg Smith and that's an old old uh, old identity and uh, have a look at uh, you know some of my articles particularly uh, the article what's your totem animal and so you know Google what's your totem animal you'll find it on so cyberty s o C-Y-B-E-R-T-Y -Y, and uh, just let me know what you think of it and if you have a totem uh, tell me what your totem animal is and why and post a photo if you can and like I said make a video response so have a great day that's the Liberty Wave by the way <laughs> okay bye bye